There are two types of dance studio owners. And before you take advice from anybody in this industry, you need to know what kind you are and what kind they're speaking to in their advice and their content. My name is Bryce Common. I'm one of the co-founders of Dance Motion Marketing. And every year we help hundreds of dance studios radically transform their businesses, sometimes doubling or tripling their enrollments, their revenue, and their profit. And we see on a daily basis the clash of these two types of studio owners. The first kind is what we call the artist owner. And the second is the entrepreneur. The artist owner is someone who got into business because they love dance. They were a dancer and they just want to share their love of dance with somebody else. For these owners, things like spreadsheets, follow-up, lead management, total snooze fest. They're in the business because they want to have fun and they want to share their love of dance with others. And there's nothing wrong with that. The second kind of studio owner is the entrepreneur. The entrepreneur shows up and they realize that dance is not a hobby business and you can make a lot of money if you choose to. These are owners who prioritize revenue growth. They are looking to grow their business at every turn. They care about things like lead follow-up. They care about things like revenue and profit tracking and that's the stuff that's going to make them win. These owners want to have fun in their business too, but they think that cashing a massive check at the end of the month is super fun. Now, I'm not going to tell you how to run your business. The whole point of being an entrepreneur is you get to make the rules in your life. You can run your business however you want. But when a guru shows up and says you need to do X, Y, and Z, you need to understand if they're talking to an artist owner or if they're talking to an entrepreneur. Because what I see all the time is that the advice that's given is given for entrepreneurs and then artist owners try to follow it and it doesn't work for them and they're frustrated and they're burnt out. And then they go from coaching organization to coaching organization. They go from DSOA to Misty Lowen to Regold to us to whoever else because it just doesn't work for me. Well, it doesn't work because you haven't made the appropriate mindset change to make that advice work. If you want to rapidly grow your business, and I mean rapidly, and I'm telling you right now, it's not going to be easy and it's going to take work. Reach out to our team at Dance Motion Marketing. Let's figure out which kind you are. If you're a studio owner and you needed to hear this, or if you know a studio owner and they need to hear this, like, comment, share so we can help more studio owners be less frustrated in their dance businesses.